Hi, and welcome to this section of the Algebra Word Problem Tutor, where we're going to, to deal with problems involving ages, okay? Uh, and this is something you see uh, in basic math problems, and SAT problems, and GRE problems, and in any kind of algebra problem, you'll always come across a problem that deals with Sally's age and, and, and just Jesse's age or something, and the ages are related, and, and there's a bunch of words in there telling you how he's older than she is, and she is two times as old as he was ten years ago, and things like that, and then you'll have to find the age of these people, and uh, those are the kinds of problems that we're going to work today, and uh, these kinds of problems are really no different than, than any of the problems we've done before, uh, you know, you just have to take it step by step, look at the problem, look at the words, and get some practice with taking those words and putting them down into equation form so that, so that you can solve them. So that's what we're going to get practice with today. So let's go ahead and get started with the first problem and, uh, and learn by examples, which is what we do in this course anyway. Uh, first problem is this. Jake is 12 years old, okay, and he's also six years older than his brother Ted, okay. How old is Ted? Okay. Now we're starting out with some easy problems. Okay. This is a problem that, uh, that I know that you can solve without using algebra. Okay. You'll find that a lot of algebra problems are like that in the beginning, that you don't need algebra to be able to solve them. You can use your head. Well, we're rapidly going to get into some problems that I think uh, that, that uh, very few people can solve in their head. So we're, we're starting with an easy one to show you how to start to use algebra so that you get comfortable with it. Okay. So this is a simple one. Jake is 12 years old. And he's also six years older than his brother, Ted. How old is Ted? I think you can all figure out uh, how old Ted is without using a lot of algebra, but let's go ahead and use some algebra here to get some practice, okay? So what we're going to do, we want to find out uh, Ted's age. So Ted, 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 is the, uh, Ted is the unknown. We don't know his age, right? That's what the question asks. You always look to see what the question is actually asking you. Ted is the unknown. So we're going to use variable x. Uh, to be Ted's age, okay? I always write it down on my paper. Ted's age is variable x so that you never forget what exactly the variable is you're talking about, okay? Uh, so in equation form right here where it says uh, Jake is 12 years old and he's also six years older than his brother uh, Ted. How old is Ted? You want to write that down into equation form and, uh, and this is how you would do this. Okay, okay. so what you want to do is, you know, in words, if you were going to write this down in words, you would say that, you know, forgetting about x, you would say Ted's age, just translating the problem, okay, plus six uh, years, okay, uh, is equal to Jake's age, right? That, that's, that's what's going on here, right? That's what's going on. Uh, in words, because that's what the problem actually says. It says Jake is 12 years old, and he's also six years older than his brother Ted. So six years older than his brother Ted, six plus Ted's age is Jake's age. So that's what the, that's what it is in equation form here. Now using using the language of algebra, we've said that the variable x is Ted's age. That's what we're trying to find. X plus six, just from the six years, is equal to Jake's age, which was given to us in the problem. So that's 12. Okay. Now you don't really need to do this step, and in a lot of problems you won't do that step, but I just wanted to write it down so it's clear what we're doing. Ted's age, which we've defined to be some number x, we don't know what it is, plus 6 years is equal to 12 years, which is his brother Jake's age. And that just comes straight from the problem where it says that Jake is 12 years old and he's also 6 years older than his brother Ted. 6 years older than some unknown age, 